I'm Mike Gracia with an AP News Minute. In London, mourners continue to pay their respects to Queen Elizabeth II, waiting in queue that stretched up to 16 hours. President Biden departed Washington Saturday morning, bound for London, ahead of the Queen's state funeral on Monday. A meeting between Biden and new British Prime Minister Liz Truss that was planned for Sunday has been called off. Tropical storm Fiona was nearing Puerto Rico Saturday. Forecasters say it could dump up to 20 inches of rain. A powerful storm, the remnants of what was Typhoon Mirbach, hammered Alaska early Saturday. Clarabelle Lewis says this is the most powerful storm she's experienced in her 20 years in Gullivan, Alaska. We've had flooding in the past um, a few times, but it was never this severe. In Belgrade, Serbia. Riot police clashed Saturday with soccer hooligans who were protesting a pan-European pride march. U.S. Ambassador Christopher Hill was among the march's participants. Former Trump White House Press Secretary Sarah Sanders is out of the hospital after undergoing surgery Friday for thyroid cancer. A spokesman says the 40-year-old Sanders, who's running for governor in Arkansas, will be back on the campaign trail soon. Authorities in Boulder County, Colorado, say two small airplanes collided in mid-air Saturday, killing three people. A Cessna 172 and Sonex Xenos aircraft collided near Longmont, Colorado. I'm Mike Gracia, AP News.